Hello and welcome to our Wednesday noon spiritual mind treatment. As usual, if this is your first time joining us for this spiritual mind treatment, this spiritual practice that we call affirmative prayer, if this is your first time, I am Reverend Dr. Raymond Anderson, Senior Minister of the Center for Spiritual Living Greater Baltimore, and I will be leading us in this prayer. So if this is your first time and you have no idea what I'm talking about when I say spiritual mind treatment, just know that it is a prayer from the consciousness of God, from spirit, rather than praying to God or spirit. There is no begging, there is no beseeching, there is no bargaining. It's simply declaring what we know to be true. It's in the same way that Yeshua in the Bible said to pray as though you have already received. So basically, it's a declaration of the gratitude for having already received, for already being. Okay? And as always, if there's ever a prayer request, feel free to send it to myself or uh, the Center for Spiritual Living Greater Baltimore. You can do so via the Facebook page. You can do so via the website, cslgreaterbaltimore.org. There's a couple of ways. So just know that you can always send a prayer request. So in this moment, let us simply anchor, anchoring to the breath, releasing all of the busyness that came before this moment and simply being present right here and right now. Bring, being present to the temperature in the air, being present to any stress that we may feel in our body temple, being present to the rise and the fall of our chest and abdomen as we breathe, simply being present. And it is from this place of presence that I speak what I know. That which God is, is all there is. It being all there is, then it must be precisely where and what and who I am. It is the very incarnation of my being. And because God is all there is, it must also be every person joining in this prayer right now. Whenever they are joining, whether that is in a week, in a day, in a minute, Every individual who is joining in with this video, everyone who is anchoring into this truth, that which God is must also be precisely who, what, and where they are. The fullness of that which Voltaire said, God is a circle whose circumference is nowhere, whose center is everywhere. The very center of God is right here. The very center of God is speaking these words. The very center of God is feeling the vibration of these words. The very center of God is watching this video and anchoring and joining in this declarative prayer. The very center of God. All that God is as absolute love right here, right now as absolute joy right here, right now, as absolute freedom right here and right now. We say in the Declaration of Principles that we believe that the ultimate goal of life to be a complete freedom or emancipation from every discord of every nature right here and right now, that freedom is present in, through, and as me. In, through, and as every person watching and joining in in, through, and as freedom, in, through, and as emancipation from every discord of every nature, be that discord physical dis-ease, illness, mental, psychological, emotional, relationships, financial, political, whatever the discord right here and right now, anchoring in this truth, recognizing that that which God is, is all there is, Recognizing that the freedom that God is, the very power of this freedom that God is, is right now showing itself forth. Just as these words are being spoken by spirit, through spirit, as spirit, back unto spirit, then I know that this vibration cannot return to me void. It cannot return to any one of us void and not expressed, not manifested, not experienced. This prayer... The universe speaking its truth about itself. So, health, wealth, joy, power, 
courage, freedom. Freedom in this breath. Freedom recognizing that political systems and systems of oppression have outlived their purposefulness. That the freedom that God is right here and right now must be and is transforming these systems. So that justice and equality and equanimity, so that health care, education, eco-friendliness, sustainability, love, oneness, must be the experience. And that means that right here and right now, as I speak this, that every cell of my body is raising in vibration to do what is mine to do, to be the very demonstration and manifestation of this. That I am not being called to simply sit by and observe, but that I am an active participant in the life that is God. And what is true for me is true for all, because God is all there is. So everyone joining in this declarative prayer right now, everyone joining in this truth right now, also is being raised up energetically, raised up spiritually, raised up intellectually, raised up in courage and power and purpose to do what is theirs to do. That every individual is a piece of the grand puzzle of creation, of divinity. That there is no person who has no purpose. There is no person who has no reason for being. That right here and right now, coming together, synergy, coalescing together, unity, joining in what is truth. So I surrender this into the law knowing that it is already being, already demonstrating, already showing itself, already being that which is the experience, because the law always says yes. I know there is only one life, and that life is God's life, and that life is that which this prayer has spoken. Freedom in expression, love in expression, oneness and joy in expression. Higher levels of political, educational, and economic well-being for the planet, a world that works for all. And because I know that this one life, God's life, that which God is living, breathing, and moving itself in through and as me and as all, then I know that that which God is as divine and infinite power, peace, joy, love, magnificence is. It is. It is that which is being experienced. It is that which is demonstrating, that which is manifesting. It is the very foundation upon which all of life is. And so, knowing that this is the truth of God about itself, speaking through itself, I surrender this back into the mind that is God itself, for there is only that one mind. And in the mind of God, this that is a world that works for all. In the mind of God, this that is freedom. In the mind of God, that which is love is already fully formed and fully functioning. And so I do what is mine to do to bring from God's mind to my mind, to my body, to my hands, to my mouth, to my eyes, to my heart, to my life, recognizing that this is what is mine to do. Breathing in recognition of this, breathing in surrendering this, breathing in allowing that which God is to be it in through and as me. I surrender it knowing it is done, knowing it is so. And together we declare and say, and so it is. Amen. Much love.